A type of gene therapy is helping children with congenital hearing loss. CBS 17's Liz Ortiz is here now with more on that for us. Liz. All right, Angela. Surgeons are calling this a medical breakthrough. One child can now hear thanks to this gene therapy. A good luck kiss goodbye as this 11-year-old from Spain is wheeled into surgery at the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia on October 3rd. He was born unable to hear and has become the first person to get gene therapy in the United States for congenital deafness. What we've really accomplished is, is exciting because it's the first time that uh, hearing has been restored uh, in, a, in a child, really in a human being, for a hereditary type of hearing loss. A CHOP surgeon developed a cutting-edge, minimally invasive endoscope that allowed the gene therapy to be surgically placed directly into the inner ear. The idea here is to replace a defective gene that a child is born with, restore that gene to the inner ear by literally injecting it into the inner ear. And it's a surgical procedure to do that, but it's exciting because if we can get the gene back in and get it functioning, it should restore hearing. Now, almost four months after the operation, he's back for testing and raises his hand, indicating he's hearing. Since receiving the experimental treatment in one ear, the boy's hearing has improved significantly. For safety reasons, the FDA wanted researchers to start with older children and only treat one ear. We've always wanted to be able to restore natural hearing. And we're finally, and we've been waiting 30 years for this to be here, and it's finally here now. Um, and that is restoring a defective gene that you're born with. He was reportedly initially frightened by noises and voices he'd never heard before, but now says he enjoys hearing everything. Now, while the gene therapy corrected an abnormality in one very rare gene, surgeons say they hope this research can eventually open the door for future use on other genes that cause childhood hearing loss. Guys. Yeah, that would be fantastic mm -hmm. if it did. All right, Liz, thank you.